Hi everyone, it's Pam Kinneberg here with BasePaint.com and today we're going to be painting a New Year's design. I'm going to be starting with Craze Metallic Gold and Magenta and a petal sponge from Craze. And I've double loaded it with the um, magenta on the end and the gold in the front part so that I get a little bit of that uh, magenta on the edge of the eyelid. Then I'm using a 1 4th inch flat brush. Uh, to tell you the truth, I don't know where I got this from. I think it came in a paint palette, <clears throat> but it's a nice little size, so I like to use it um, for areas where I need just a smaller flat brush. And I'm going to paint the gold um, New Year's Eve hat right up above the eyebrow. And you can um, just take a sponge and um, tap on it to smooth out that um, that color so it doesn't have brush strokes in it <clears throat> and then I'm just going to put a little bit of craze brown on the edges just to give it some dimension like it's going um, um, it's a rounded shape and then you could just tap that out and blend it in a little bit next I'm going to take that same brush with that same metallic gold and I'm going to paint the flat parts of my ribbon um, <clears throat> and then I'm going to be connecting them later but I like to use my gold uh, on my brush when I have it loaded so that there are less steps that way. <clears throat> this is where you're going to want to know where your um, ribbon is going so it's nice to practice it a few times. And then I'm going to take that edge of the brush, still loaded with gold, and I'm going to make that little frilly and um, frilly edge to the New Year's Eve cap. Um, <clears throat> just tap the edge right um, over and turn the brush many different ways so it's not all going the same direction. And I'll do the same for that top little pom pom. Then I'm going to take white craze paint and I'm going to um, paint my highlights on that ribbon. Um, <clears throat> again, you know, I'm going to show you everything you can do and you can pick and choose the parts that you'd like to do depending on how much time you have. So this isn't necessary, but it certainly does look make it look uh, more three-dimensional. And I paint a little bit of a highlight right on the hat also. And you can blend that in. Then I'm going to take my white brush on my brush and make some more little flat areas with my brush just to give that hat some multiple colors. Then I'm using the BAM stencil pyramids and I'm going to just tap black, craze black, onto the hat to make that pattern of little triangles on the hat to give it a little more festive look. And then uh, with the Craze number one round black brush, I'm gonna take some brown Craze paint and just make and connect these um, sections of the ribbon together because the underneath it would be a little darker. So we're just connecting and making them look like one little curly um, ribbon um, piece. them, filling in the areas a little bit on the sides just to give that edge a little bit of darkness. And um, then a few flicks in the hat really part to give it some dimension there. And then I'm going to take the black and outline my hat. I'm also going to do some outlining on the ribbon, but you wouldn't have to. Um, this is just an extra step just to give it a little bit more contrast and definition, but you could leave it just as it was with that dark brown in there. a little bit of black in the frilly part. Now I'm putting white as a highlight on the top of each of those ribbon sections 
further enhancing that dimension, that 3D quality. And then with that brush, I'm going to just add some little dots like it's confetti from the little New Year's Eve party that you're having. And then I'm going to take my liquid bling and give it some gold dots uh, in the midst of all of those white little dots to give it some um, bling and it almost looks like little gems. And then I'm going to take some Gleam um, Chunky Glitter Cream in the gold and put it over the fringe and over the hat just to give that some um, fun glitter to it also. Don't forget to paint the lips. It's a really um, good idea on this one to give it some more color. I put some gold glitter on top of the lips. And there you have a very festive, fun New Year's Eve design. Happy painting, everyone!